So Guidance Residential was established in 1999 uh, with a three years multi-million dollar uh, research and development and with 18 law firms that went up against the government for them to allow us actually to accept Islamic financing program that we offer today. Alhamdulillah, we opened our first office in 2002 in three states. Guidance Residential today operates in more than 30 states. Alhamdulillah, we're really, we're really proud of what we accomplished so far. So far, we've closed more than $8 billion in Islamic financing in the U.S. Last year alone, uh, we did $1.1 billion. Alhamdulillah, this number is from our community, from, our, from the trust that we got from our community. Myself and, our, and my team here in the state of Washington, last year alone, we closed $160 million in home financing. That is more than 300 home financed in the state of Washington alone, alhamdulillah. It was very difficult. There was huge misconceptions before about 2015, correct? Yes. So before 2015, the community thought that we were just um, another conventional bank that, that promotes Islamic financing. Mm -hmm. But alhamdulillah, in 2015, um, there was a MJ meeting, Assembly Muslim Jurist of, of America. And, uh, and this um, is where all the ulamas and the shaykhs from all different states of, of, Washington, of America, they come together and they discuss important matters. And, in 2015, the important matter was Islamic financing. And alhamdulillah, they gave us a fatwa saying that we are a permissible path of Islamic financing. Um, and alhamdulillah, after this, after I've shown people this video of these shaykhs talking about our company and uh, our musharaka contract, they have they become a lot more relaxed. And you know, now that I have proof, you know, I have I have evidence now. So alhamdulillah. In, in addition to Amja, alhamdulillah, you know, a lot of our community, the masajids, the ulama is here in Washington as well. They're very aware of Amja, who are the Amja ulamas. They're very well known, uh, uh, Sheikh Salah Hassawi, Dr. Man al-Qudda, these are very well known in Islamic finance. After that, Alhamdulillah, it has been easier as well for them to actually endorse our, community, uh, our contract, uh, you know, the communities, the ulamas in, in Washington as well. Home ownership, it's a crazy generation wealth. And I, it's unfortunate that Muslim America is actually one of the most qualified community in the United States. However, Muslim Americans has been out of home ownership, obviously, for understandable reason. Because Riba, obviously, Alhamdulillah, Guidance Residential, I think Guidance Residential has changed that. Uh, we opened our office in the state of Washington 10 years ago. With that, Alhamdulillah, today we have our office in Tukwila, in the, at the heart of our community here. That have made a huge impact in our community for them to buy a home, achieve the American dream. Means they can come ask questions, it's always easier to, know, to talk to someone within your community, understand your culture, understand your language as well. I think that has made a difference uh, in our community to become homeowners. And I, I want to add one, uh, uh, one research done on this. In America, an average homeowner's net worth is 47% higher than renting. That's how we are immigrants. We've been behind. When it comes to wealth, we're not there. And in America, the best way to build the wealth is real estate. For someone to jump into a middle class family, Real estate can get you there. Abdisa and I, our biggest passion is helping our community. We want to help our community become homeowners because a lot of our community thinks, thinks that, oh, we're, we're here, we need a rent. And renting, you're not going to gain any profit from that. You're not going to gain equity in it. When you're able to get home ownership, you build generational wealth for you and your family. And, and that's what we want. You know, Abdisa always tells me my biggest passion and, and thing I love the most is that I was able to help my whole Oroma community become homeowners. And I want to do the same thing with my Somali community, inshallah. I want to be able to help my Javieras and my, and my Aftis, you know, inshallah, all of us, inshallah, to become homeowners. Well, I, I want us, you know, there's a lot of misconception going on in the community. Yeah. I want our community, the immigrant community, the Muslim community to come our office and hear directly from the source. Don't go around, inshallah, you know, rumors here and there. She say, he say so. Come to our office. That's why we open office here. We are here to help our community and clear 100% our contracts, Musharaka contracts, acceptable and halal. Please come and ask the question directly from the source. Okay, uh, and I just want to say that, you know, my, my biggest passion and the reason why I really came towards this job is that I, I want to help my Somali community. It's Somali community, you know, it's, it's very special to me, inshallah. So please, like Abdisa said, come to the office so we can answer your questions. Don't listen to what this person says, what that person says, inshallah. Hear it from us. We are the professionals, inshallah.